Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel, and um, I've got a pretty big um, uh, number of people that have finally got this uh, news and interest panel, which gives you the weather, and of course, if you uh, click or hover over it, uh, you get that panel of news and stuff, and depending on how you set up your PC, it shows differently. Of course, this is now enabled for every buddy and it is on by default and i get tons of people saying i don't want this what do i do to get it off and once again i will show you guys how to take it off your pc right click on the taskbar go into news and interest and just turn off and it's going to disappear i do have another question which is i don't want to turn it off but I want to change one thing. I want to change the fact that by default it opens on hover, which means you just go and not even click on it and it actually shows up, which means if you might be going through your icons in the taskbar and because you're going there, it's like, oh, look at that, it popped up and I don't want it to pop up. And depending on the speed of your computer, sometimes that pop up can take a little bit of time. So you want to keep it, but you want to remo remove the um, you know uh, hovering feature where just hovering over it opens it. Right click, taskbar, news and interest, and just remove the up open on hover. The other thing is, some people say it seems to update a lot, and, and I don't know, but it it seems to have um, some weird you know, um, effect on my system, you can click reduce the, uh, let's go back, reduce taskbar updates. What that does is that it simply, instead of, you know, checking out every like five minutes or 10 minutes or 15 minutes to uh, refresh itself, it actually now takes a longer period of time. So it doesn't actually um, update as often. Uh, for some people, apparently, it might be causing some little kind of slowdown bugs while they're using their PC. So that's the way that it can be done. But once again, for all of you out there that just don't want it, once again, right click, go into news and interest, and turn off. And it's going to turn off from your PC. And if any of you out there don't have it, there's something preventing you from having it. Uh, anybody that has removed Microsoft Edge will not see this. Microsoft Edge Stable needs to be installed for this to actually work. So if you don't have the Microsoft Edge Stable installed, then you won't see the news and interest panel at all. It is required because it uses Edge uh, rendering for this to work fine. So that's... All I have to say, and I won't post another video again about how to remove this. Uh, this is the last time I'm showing this. The only um, thing I would maybe do is if they ever change the news and interest panel and do something else. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.